Of course, every carrot has a fat end and a trimmed end. You want to make sure that when you're working with your carrots, you take safety first. They're quite heavy, and uh, they roll around. Trim a little bit off the bottom. Then you want to start peeling from the butt end to make sure you get as much yield out of your carrot as possible. Remember, sharp knives are safe knives. You want to work uh, cutting out the root end, dispose. Take off the little tip as well. These parts can be quite dry. And then find a natural rolling point on this carrot. And if you need to, trim it up just slightly once again. Now we have a very safe carrot to work with. Cut them into manageable sized pieces. Larger hands need larger carrots. Next thing, we're going to take it down and show you three simple cuts. Cut your carrot in half. Cut it in half once again. Now you have these nice little triangle shapes. From that, you can do a simple slice. Uh, our next cut will simply work on what we call an oblique cut. Same style where we're cutting our little triangles but then we want to work on cutting at quarter angles every time. That produces a cut that has a lot of little angles, it gives you a little different crunch, a little texture, to whatever you're using them for. So two simple cuts. The final one, which works well for people who are on the go, simply cut your carrots into six or quarters, and you get great little carrot sticks. Fit them to any lunch bag, Ziploc bag, try it with uh, one of the healthy dips that we have today.